Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of CVTV. This is Carlos from Coralview and I'm here at Denver 2014 Magna. I'm here with our good friend Keith Warren from Living Color and he's going to tell us about the, the, his experience with the DC pump, with our new RO DC pump. Uh, basically we started using them on a couple of our systems. In our lobby aquarium we have one of the protein skimmers that has a DC pump. It is the quietest pump I think I've ever heard on a protein skimmer. Mm -hmm. uh, you cannot hear it at all. It's amazing. The nice thing is with the controller, you can speed it up or slow it down. It gives you one more adjustment in the level. So um, if you have a little bit of hard time adjusting the bubbles inside your skimmer, it makes it a little bit easier for you. Mm -hmm. You're using this on your systems? I, um, some of your systems? Uh, yeah, I'm looking at basically going from some of the older pumps, older style pumps, to integrating the DC pumps because it gives you the, the controllability where as the corals grow inside your tank, you could add a little bit more speed, bump it up one more. Mm -hmm. You could slow it down at night or however you want to do it. When you're feeding the fish, you will put on the feed mode. It'll cut off and then obviously turn back on in the next 15 minutes. This is a new line of sumps that we're making. Um, comes in six sizes, but it's basically going to have your mechanical filtration, your biological filtration using the Seachem Pond Matrix. Right in here, it's all designed around the um, Reef Octopus SSS series protein skimmers. So this one here is the, uh, this is the 160 Classic. And then you have the bubble trap and your return chamber where we have the Reef Octopus um, 5500 DC pump. Okay. And right for the show, we just have it recirculating, but obviously on an aquarium, you'd pump it up to the tank. Thank you again for everybody for watching. Uh, don't forget to place comments below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And, you, and we'll see you next week.